Hi Pre-K. I hope everyone is having an amazing day and I miss you guys so much. Today the activity that I have for you is feather beating and it's like regular beating except we use feathers instead of strings or ribbons or stuff like that. And if you don't have any feathers at home, that's okay. You can go and grab some little sticks from outside or if you have some somewhere in your house. And if you don't have any beads, that's okay. You can use straws. I cut up some little straws to use today. And I also went to my kitchen and got some cereal that has some holes in the middle so I could stick it on the feather and on the sticks. So you just take your feather like this and you put some straws on there. You can put as many straws as you want. If you only want two straws, you could leave space in between them or you could leave them really close. It doesn't really matter. It's however you want to make it because it is your creation. When you're done, you can take them off in any direction. You notice that it gets smaller and the feathers get closer together when you put the straws on. When you take them off, they separate again and then you could just separate them with your fingers and get them back out again and then you can put some cereal on your feathers you can do all the same color you can do different colors you could do some patterns so here I have orange green green I'll put another orange then I can put another green and then next would come another green. And then if I follow the pattern, my orange one would be next. That one doesn't quite fit. It's okay, you just grab another one. And then just slide them off. And you can keep redoing it and making different patterns. Or you could keep it and you could put it up with your other art. And you can do the same exact thing with these sticks and it stays pretty well. You can mix them up together or you can switch them up and go back to doing the straws. It's your creation. You can use different colored straws, different colored cereal, all the same colors. You could also use some pipe cleaners that works as well. I know some, a lot of you guys probably have some of those lying around. But these were just some easy things that you can find. Feathers, sticks, straws, and cereal. Alright, Pre-K, that's all I have for you guys today. See you next time. Bye!